So what does your role involve? Because it's quite different. What I really love now is a lot of that work that I used to do for our own brands, I now do with um, clients and partners um, and other brands to help them build their content network, which I think is actually really exciting. What sort of content should agencies be focusing on and producing? I guess the thing to remember is that it doesn't all have to be giant long form video. Like it's really important to know like how are your um, consumers or your audience or your buyers or um, sellers, how are they actually going to interact with your brand um, and making a bit of a plan that way will help you kind of get more bang for your buck or certainly um, make sure you're making some good decisions. How do I approach the strategic side of it? You don't want to try and be all things to everybody. Like. You know, my recommendation is don't try and feed every single platform. There's a lot of social platforms. Pick the ones that you're, the people that you're trying to target are in. What sort of topics are you looking for for how to's, you know, where would people find that? So start with the biggest question you're asked. And to be honest, your how to's might come off what your FAQs are. You might go, this is your list of FAQs that you're asked all the time. Here's an answer for them. If you've identified that two or three of them are ones that are really the ones you get asked a lot, take that as your inspiration of just step it out. Just literally like you would talk to someone. We know that Lux Listings and Million Dollar Agent has just really sparked this interest in being a real estate agent. So how can agents use this, um, that trend to best effect? I totally recommend don't overthink that. Just capturing snippets where you see what's going on in the background. Perfect for short, fast um, content that can happily disappear. It's not evergreen. It's not searchable. It doesn't need to be. Don't put too much pressure on it. How can we spice up those staff profiles to be a bit more interesting when it comes to a piece of content? Whatever it is that you think um, looks like trust in your world. So if it's market intelligence, talk about how many years you've been doing it and um, even perhaps an interesting fact that you've learned because you've been in it for so long. So really ladder to the USP you're trying to position. Um, If you're in a more suburban, you're talking to families, share a bit about the fact that you're a family or a story when you purchase something. Like just sharing a little bit of who you are as a person, again, it will help. How can you use an insight into your culture to build a rapport with an audience? Carefully crafted cultural content is great. Um, I wouldn't recommend doing it on the spot. It's not one of those things that I, I think I wouldn't be someone who would recommend live. I think always if you're going to showcase some of what your team do as a culture, capture it and then have a think about later on what the best way to package it up is.